वेलकम टू इजी बायोलॉजी द हार्ट हार्ट इज अ मस्कुलर ऑर्गन इट्स फंक्शन इज टू पंप ब्लड मीन्स टू सेंड ब्लड टू द होल बॉडी द राइट साइड पंप्स ब्लड थ्रू द पलमनरी सर्किट while the left side pumps blood through systemic circuit so our heart has two main circuits and a septum separates the right and left sides the left side has thicker walls because it needs to put the blood under higher pressure than the right side so this is a complete heart shown in front of you i want you to raise your right hand remember your right side is actually the left side of the heart so the upper part of the left side of the heart is known as left atrium and the upper part of right side of heart is right atrium and the lower left side of the heart is left ventricle and this lower right side of the heart is left the is right ventricle so this entire is the left side and this one is the right side in this heart this vessel that is connected with the left atrium his pulmonary vein and the vessel connected with right atrium is vena cava and the blood vessel that takes the blood from right ventricle out of the heart is pulmonary artery and the largest artery and the artery that takes blood out of the left ventricle is aorta this is the entire labeling of the heart and the part that separates left and right side of the heart is known as septum as we just studied in the previous slide you have to learn the labeling of the heart a very important thing is your cardiac cycle this cycle basically tells that how does the blood flow from your heart to the whole body let's start off when the blood is coming back from the body so from the body the blood comes back to the heart through vena cava so blood enters the heart to through vena cava and it reaches the right atrium so it enters the right atrium then from the right atrium it goes to right ventricle this is right atrium and from here it goes to right ventricle and here you can see this tricuspid valve this opens when the blood is passing and as the blood reaches ventricle tricuspid valve closes then from the right ventricle blood goes to the lungs through pulmonary artery so from here it goes out through pulmonary artery straight to the lungs then in the lungs carbon dioxide is given out and oxygen is absorbed as oxygen is absorbed so the blood coming back to the heart is oxygenated so oxygenated blood enters from the left side of the heart through pulmonary vein so here is the pulmonary vein that brings the oxygenated blood to the left atrium now the blood is in left atrium as left atrium contracts it pumps the blood to left ventricle so here you can see how blood goes to left ventricle and between left atrium and ventricle there is a valve called bicuspid valve
so this bicuspid valve closes as blood enters into left ventricle then from left ventricle the blood is pumped with a great force and it's sent to the whole body through aorta so then it passes from here and it leaves the heart through aorta which is the largest artery and it goes to the whole body this is how the blood is traveling so let me repeat this cycle once again so the deoxygenated blood comes through vena cava and from vena cava it enters the right atrium as the tricuspid valve opens it goes to right ventricle from right ventricle it travels from pulmonary artery to the lungs from in the lungs the blood gets oxygenated and it loses carbon dioxide then it comes through pulmonary vein and it enters left atrium from left atrium it travels to left ventricle and from left ventricle it is pumped out through aorta to the whole body and again the cycle continues please subscribe my channel thank you